Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Misha and as you can see by the title, today we are going to be talking about traveling. This is a travel vlog type of video. I'm going to be kind of walking you guys through a bunch of clips and footage that I have from my trip to Nigeria um, that I took with my husband and that trip um, took place December of last year. So the day after Christmas, December 26th, we took off from Canada to Nigeria came back January the 9th of this year and um, so we were there for about 10 to 11 days um, and I wanted to just give you guys a recap of that trip and kind of a perspective of a Canadian Barbadian girl going to Nigeria for the very first time. So my husband was taking me to show me where he grew up, show me his home and um, I was meeting my in-laws for the first time in person um, since we since we got married. Um, we actually just celebrated our one year wedding anniversary um, last month, which is exciting. So I'm finally getting around to putting together all the footage from this trip. It was an awesome trip. Um, I won't talk too much, I wanna really jump into it. I have my phone here with a bunch of notes um, on what I'm gonna be recapping. So if you see me looking down at any time on my phone, that's what I'm looking there for. But basically, um, I thought that we were going to be able to get to Nigeria and I would be able to document everything from day one to the end, every day, filming, capturing a bunch of things. It did not turn out that way. And that's basically because we were surprised, but um, it was really challenging to actually film there. Um, there are many places that we went where it was very awkward to be holding the camera taking pictures or filming and there were a few times where people actually asked us to put our cameras away and told us that we were not allowed to film um, and these were like public play areas outdoors so it was really strange but they didn't complain if we were using our cell phones which ultimately does the same thing but um cell phone was fine but using our actual cameras usually caused a problem so you'll see that some of the footage is some of it is iphone footage um some of it my husband even had a little GoPro camera that he was enjoying using throughout the trip. Anyways, without further ado, this next clip is just us on December 25th, Christmas night. We are finalizing packing and just getting ready to take off the next day. It's the most wonderful day of the year. You see, we pack guys, we are packing, we're not moving. We're going to Nigeria. Okay. And I'm watching my Arsenal highlights. We're gonna be bringing you guys some some nice videos. Anticipate. <laughs> my bag. My bag is ready. And my bags are ready. My wife is not carrying too much. See, that's why it's good for you to have a wife that doesn't have too much load. Hmm? I'm carrying three bags. She's carrying three bags. I'm carrying three and a half because I have to carry myself. Yeah, I'm carrying two carry-on, one chest. I think I have everything I need, but I'm just double-checking. So how do you feel? You're going to Nigeria, babe. I'm excited. I haven't had a vacation in general in a long time. And I've never been to Nigeria before, so I'm excited. I'm really excited. I'm going to travel with my babe for the first time. This is the baby. <laughs> For the first time, so I'm really excited. Can't wait. Yeah, we're gonna be seeing Nigeria. Our flight, uh, our flight will be taking us through London, London, Qatar, Qatar to Lagos. And uh, we've been giving heads up already that we're not tipping anybody in Nigeria. Nigeria is against tipping. No tipping. <laughs> I wish. I wish this guy ever happened. Well, that's what we thought. Excitement, excitement. Let's see how this goes. Okay, so we had an evening flight from um, Toronto Pearson International Airport. And um, I, I think that flight was around 8 or 9 p.m. at night on the 26th. So, um, our itinerary was like we were to go from Toronto, Ontario to London, England 
and then from London, England to um, Doha, Qatar, and then from Qatar to Nigeria. Right here, you're about to see us um, in Toronto, just a couple of clips, and then um, in London as well. I was exhausted. So leading up to Christmas, I was not even sleeping that well because of just nerves. We were super, super busy planning for the trip and then as well as just like things for Christmas. Also, I didn't get my visa till the day before we traveled. So honestly, we were doing all of our planning in faith in hopes that like I was gonna get this visa. So that's a whole other story, <laughs> but um, we, there was just so much last minute. So basically like Christmas Eve, I barely slept and Christmas night was our finalizing everything and I think I might have slept like three or four hours so I was already tired so then like the next day would have been perfect for me to like catch up on sleep on the plane <laughs> but I couldn't for some reason I don't really sleep on planes so our first flight from Toronto to London was seven hours and I did not sleep at all so you'll see that um, when you see me in London, I'm not talking a whole lot. Um, hubby is the one that's filming and I'm just like barely functioning. So here are these clips. Hi guys, we checked in. <sighs> We're going to warm weather at last. There. That was hectic, eh? That was very hectic. Very, very, very hectic. Very, to very, travel very in hectic. COVID nowadays is, is, is not the best thing ever, man. But we made it. We made it. We made it. Praise God. Yes. <laughs> We're going to Nigeria. But first stop, United Kingdom. Let's go get United. Hello. So we're back. We're actually waiting for our food. This is... Uh, I don't. Yeah. What did you order? Um, we ordered a chicken sandwich. I forgot. I think it was a fried chicken sandwich. Um, yeah, just to eat something for now. I think we'll be food on the plane, but um, we're pretty hungry. I'm feeling sleepy and I'm hungry, but it's a good thing. It's a uh, good timing. This we got here on time. We are sitting in, in the check-in area right now, just waiting for the. Uh, we're just at the gate, waiting for them to start calling us in. What's up, Michael? Uh, in London. We are in London, Etro. My hand is kind of shaking. I've not slept well in this. How are you feeling now? Oh, <laughs> she's psyching my head. Look at the plane landing, look at the plane landing! Look at the landing, look at the landing. So our flight in London was actually delayed um, for I think about an hour or so. Um, and so that flight from London to Doha, Qatar was around another seven hours. And um, since that flight was delayed in taking off and delayed in landing for whatever reason, we were just in the air longer than we were supposed to be, we had, I think, maybe like five minutes or so to catch our connecting flight. Let's picture this, like, my husband is running, he has a backpack and um, his saxophone bag in his hand. I have um, a backpack that's quite heavy and um, like a rolling carry-on suitcase. So we're running and it's crowded, you know, and you're running through people. Um, so we're running, he's ahead of me and like we're looking at the time, trying to figure out like where our gate, the gate is um, and he's ahead of me now. I am like losing my breath and I'm exhausted still because I probably slept maybe like a couple pa a couple hours very patchy off and on on that last flight. So at one point I just remember 
like almost falling like I tripped over my shoe my bag like twisted and I almost fell like face face down in the airport I luckily caught myself before I fell but I remember um, AY turning around to look for me and I remember just being like go 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 like, like telling him to just like leave me behind um, because I just knew that like if he could just get to get there hopefully he could obviously let them know that like to wait for me <laughs> like you know his, that his wife was still coming one of us just had to get there um, and it's funny because we did I did notice a couple other people who looked like they might he, they looked like they might be Nigerians and I, I remember seeing one guy like that noticed AY running and then he started running it too so like there was like a few people like running at full speed and I figured that they were trying to get on the same flight so when I lost him in the crowd I couldn't even see him anymore and then I caught my breath and like started running again um, but I couldn't see him and I couldn't remember the gate like where we were going so I was literally just like following the other people that I saw running and hoping that they were going <laughs> on the same flight so it was crazy but um we made it on <laughs> so that was that Anyways, no footage from Doha, Qatar, but on the next clips you will see us in Nigeria. So um, we are actually at home in the next clip and we had just arrived, I believe, not too long ago. So it's like daytime. It's I think we were supposed to arrive at 6am in Nigeria. And then when we got home, we took a really long nap. I don't think we did anything else that day. I think we pretty much just slept and relaxed. So anyways, here's a few more clips of a couple days in Nigeria. So we're home. That's mommy. Uh, okay, let's remove masks. That's, yeah. that's mommy. Yeah. We're just recording like uh, short blogs as much as we can. And that is there. See me. The last time I saw this guy was very very short. It was very very short. It's good to see him again. That's my little brother. Eh? As you can see, we just got home. We have all the boxes we've not even unpacked yet. You sweating yet, babe? I feel cooler now because I feel the fans. <laughs> but I, I, I was most excited for the weather, so yeah, I, I can't complain. <laughs> can't complain. Yeah, this is everybody. Thank God we're back home. Lights, uh, we'll continue from here. Yeah, Good yeah. morning, Nigeria. It's day two in Nigeria. Today we are about to leave the room. That's Madame. She looks stressed out already. I think I've stressed her ass out already this morning, so we can leave the room early. But yeah, this is us leaving the room. We're planning to go meet the staffs of uh, my mom's my mom's office. Uh, they, some of them don't know we're even around. Um, they were not aware that we're coming. You know, Nigerian things that most things are supposed to better left as a surprise. <laughs> oh, but yeah, we're here. Good morning, sir. We're heading downstairs. We're going to be meeting mommy in a few minutes, and uh, hopefully, we start our day. Gravy. Perfect. Hey, Kara. Hey, Kara. How are you? I'm very fine, thank Welcome. you. Welcome. Congratulations. <laughs> Oh, you are so much. I'm not going to stop it. 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 I'm not going to
I'm going to go and change. But now it's there. But I don't think I will do it. I can do it. I will do it on Friday. Uh, Are you sure? I, I will do it on Friday. Yes, yes. So we are currently on our way to Redemption Camp, yep. which is like the headquarters of our church back home, our CCG. So we're going there um, to pray. What does our CCG mean? Redeemed Christian Church of God. Yes. <laughs> yes. So um, yeah, we're about to go there to pray and um, just see the grounds and stuff. I'll be able to see where my husband went to high school. One of them. <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah, so we'll just show you around a little bit when we get there. But this is us on the road now. Yeah. It's a busy and a lot of uh, photos. A busy road and a lot of photos. <laughs> so we're going to get that in work. Okay, so this was Redeemer's High School, where um, AY actually attended when he was back in Nigeria. And um, we weren't allowed to go on the premises, but these two guys were really nice. And AY was just talking to them a little bit and telling them some stories about when he went to the school. So we just took a look from the outside and then said bye. Okay, so the next day, um, AY's brother, Falabi, actually came to greet us um, at home and I met him, I think that was the first time that I met him and um, that was really cool and then we actually went back with him to his place to um, meet um, his wife, my, one of my sisters in love and um, their three boys and we actually all went out together and I think that evening we went out for dinner. It was a cool place, it was kind of like a sports bar vibe and um, so we went out with, with the family and we all got like gigantic plates of food. I just remember the food being really good and really big portions. So if I can find pictures of that, I will insert some pictures right here so you guys can see what we ate that night. But um, yeah, it was awesome meeting them and especially the boys, I loved them so much. So um, they're younger, so like it was really cool to just be around small kids and um, they called me auntie. <laughs> Okay. Oh my God, he's I've been feeding him well, so yes, he is working. Yeah, how are you? Oh my God, so he's only your. I'm not seeing you yet. I'm not seeing you. I'm right here. 
Wait, 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 Oh, yeah. Baby! <laughs> you saw yourself in the camera, you said baby. It's so nice to finally meet you after a lot of um, online conversations. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Let me get my shoes. <laughs> you, you, you've not still seen me, oh. You've not still seen me. <laughs> it's good to see you! Bye. You said bye bye, you said bye bye. <laughs> oh! You're a big boy now. Oh, don't worry, we're going out, we're going out, we're going out. This is Auntie Misha. <laughs> You're shy, eh? Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. I've been waiting to meet you guys. Auntie Misha. Good until Demi Lade knows you very well. At that point, he's going to start pulling your hand and pulling your fingers. <laughs> <laughs> Demi Lade boy! How have you guys been? Fine. Good, 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 good. I'm so happy to see you guys. I'm so happy to see you guys. Oh! You want to walk? Let me light. Let me light to walk so that it's not like I'm carrying it too much. It's <laughs> so cute, my God! Hey, hey, I got, now that you dropped your, I can see you now. <laughs> <laughs> Happy New Year! Great to see you. <laughs> How are you? How have you been? Oh, good old, really good. long. I'm good. I'm very, very good. Put him down. Has he been with so you? With your ears? Oh, oh yeah 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 he's lost he's lost the slippers. I'm like what is the box? <laughs> on me Remember? Yeah, I remember. On try on try, they wanted to wear the slippers on try. Like embarrassing me. That's the Ijebu Ijebu next. See, see me now, see me. So when I Wait, know stop, it's okay. stop, stop, so when, sorry. Yes, I, I mean I'm just warning you, so when I, it happens, <laughs> like don't be surprised. Okay. I got out of the side of the family. Okay. I don't know anything about it. So <laughs> still, this is my godson.